Hi guys, so welcome to my presentation for my calculator app um, design. So the name of my app is Count Then Lose. So I just want to give you a short a background on how I came up with the idea behind this app. So recently I've been going to the gym and trying to be healthy and I've been trying to, you know, to learn about calories and until now it's really hard for me to understand um, and to know how much calories um, you know, I should take or how much cash should I burn in a day, things like that. So I just wish that there's an app that I can use that, you know, explains that to me and tells me what to do. So that's how I came up with the Count and Lose app. So pretty much with this app, it uses um, AI and machine learning and image recognition to calculate calories in meals. So this is just like uh, some sketches of the app that I created. So it kind of gives you a dashboard and then um, it, from the dashboard, there should be buttons that you can click that would take you to the pages. So one of the pages is the calories and calculate calories in meal. So this is where your app would calculate how much calories there are in a meal and uh, calculate workout um, page uh, these are the other sketches it's supposed to give you suggestions on what uh, meals to eat and what workouts to do all right so it, it it's I, I believe it would be a great help for a lot of people uh, one of the personas that I created. His name is Mike Johnson. He's 17, high school student. So he's, he just started working out this year and he wants to be healthy but does it, he doesn't know how. He is a millennial so he um, carries his phone everywhere and um, yeah pretty much his biggest concern is that he's still a high school student so he cannot afford to hire a nutritionist or a personal trainer but the Count Then Lose app uh, resolves that for him because you know the app automatically calculates um, how much calories he burns and how much calories he take in and it gives him automatically suggestions on what works out to do and you know what food to eat moving forward so that saves him a lot of money and helps him achieve his goal. And then the second persona that I created is named Mary Jane Chase, 30 years old, full-time employee, working two jobs, and he doesn't really know about working out. You know, she doesn't have time to research what work workouts to do. She tends to eat a lot of junk food when she gets stressed. So this app helps her a lot because um, it pretty much requires little, very little input from her, but then it tells her what to eat and what what to do and that helps her a lot because she just need to follow the instructions on the app all right so here are just some wireframe wireframes that I created so you can see how everything progressed from just the sketches to the wireframes so we did some usability testings um, but in just with the wireframes uh, we got the response that uh, pretty much the app is pretty straightforward, but at the same time, some of the buttons are quite confusing. So we kind of worked on improving that. So here's here is just an uh, improvement on the wireframes. We added some color and some images, as you can see. And then finally, this is the final design in a mock-up. So this is how it would look in an actual um, iOS device. So as you can see, this is the dashboard and there's a couple of buttons. This is the Calculate Calories in Meal app. That's the final design. It's pretty nice, actually. And then this is the Calculate Calories Burned uh, page. Suggested meal plan, suggested workout pages. All right, I'm just going to show you the prototype of the app. All right, so this takes you to the dashboard and it should show you your name, your in, some information about you. Uh, there's a goal tracker, you know, how much you've burned so far. Then there's a button that takes you to, to calculate meal app. 
So as I've said, the app uses AI and machine learning. So you pretty much have to just pretty much take a picture of your food. And then the app automatically calculates the amount of calories and tells you how you're doing with your calorie intake, whether or not you're still within your uh, maximum calorie intake for the day, and then how much exercise you need to do to burn this much um, calories. So when you hit the done button, it takes you back to the main, the dashboard, and then you can click another button, which is the calculate workout app, uh, sorry, page. So it shows you how much calories you've burned in the, so far in the day. And then the buttons here, um, it uh, you use this to import data from your smart devices. And that's how the app knows how much calories you've burned. All right, and then using the input from the calculate meal and calculate work workout uh, pages, it then gives you suggested meal plans. Also, um, so it, it the meal plans make sure that you would be able to, you know, to, to reach your target weight for the week and target number of calories burned. So you just have to press on the buttons here to take you to the meal plans themselves. And then lastly, the suggested workout. So using the input as well, it you know it automatically calculates how much workout you need to do um, in the week. It kind of gives you suggestions uh, depending on what type of uh, workout you prefer. So when you hit the done button, it takes you back to the dashboard. So that's pretty much uh, the app. Um, and then finally, we did last usability testing, and overall, the response that we received were positive. And um, they said that design of the interface of the app is very engaging. It's very visually pleasing, and it work the design worked really well with um, the purpose of the app. So everyone, that's it. This is my presentation, and I hope you. Um, learn something. Thank you so much. Bye.